Hi, welcome YouTubers. Thank you for joining me. How to set up your Steadicam Curve. I would definitely say read the instructions, follow it through. You run into some problems. Uh, check out SteadicamCurve.com forward slash capability. I get a user 404 error. Uh, maybe the site is not up and running. Maybe it's abandoned. Unsure. This is what I've done to get this curve correctly set up. I use the silver weight. I place it on the back of the camera. It snaps on there firmly. I then attach it to the curve and I believe I grab a couple more weights. I have this all set up and just want to show you what type of weights I have in here. And it's the only way I can get these weights out is by uh, putting the additional one in there. Of course it's going to teeter-totter over. I'm going to place in the heavy weight and they say this weight. Those were the two weights that were given with the original curve at the original time. It leans back. I'm going to add in the double weight that was given, weights 1, 2, and 3. It still leans back. I'm going to put in the weights that was given with the kit. Still leans back. And then I'm going to put in the last weight. It still leans back. I know I need to adjust this forward some. As you can see, there is an improvement. And there I have it. Now I can fine tune the back, which I'm not going to. I just tilt it forward a little bit more. And I got my gimbal balanced with all the weights that were supplied. I am going to take out one weight at a time to show you that this will still keep its balance. I will take out one more weight. And then after that, we're going to have a problem trying to balance this. And you got it balanced. They say if you take this thing and you let it go, one, two, three, that it should not swing after that. I'm not sure how true that is. I'm not a professional. Since I've taken out a medium sized weight, I'm going to add one of these weights in because it kind of like balances things out. It makes it the correct uh, increments of weights. It starts to lean down, so now I have to adjust everything, right? So I am going to start to adjust it back just a little bit to level my cam. And you can see it starts to uh, swing and all that good stuff. Now what I want to do is take off the weight. And I want to now balance my camera. There you go. Look at that. This weight is the weight of the LCD screen. Now since I put in one of these weights, the skinny one, I have put this one in. It's going to be the weight of, now uh, you know what I meant, 
it's going to be the increments. So I now have the uh, another weight out, and it kind of almost leans forward. I need to uh, put this up back a little bit so it can level out. If I take out one weight now and I push it to the center, I still should have a balanced camera. Now you can see how it rotates. Quite annoying at times. It should really stay still. Now if I push the weight out, the last weight I have in here is the solid weight. So if I add these weights up now, three, four weights is all I have. That would be one less weight of that. So let's put in the weight they asked me to put in, two and one. And let's put in two more weights. And just slowly go down. Center the weights. And now let's take one of those weights out. And you're going to see the camera now start to uh, do some adjustments. It's going to get two lights. And take the last weight out and adjust this now. The instructions are not quite clear. Now I need to adjust this back a little or fine tune it. And it kind of leans a little. So they say you need to have that weight, and let me put the big weight in there to pop that weight out. These two weights with the LCD screen. Somehow, the information they given should exclude the LCD screen. I'm not sure why. But now since I knocked it out and found out that I got my gimbal, all set up. Maybe that will help you wow. out. Two weights, camera alone, small backpack door, nothing else. Hope this video has helped somebody out there that I found my solution. Always making this review a better review. Have a great day. Thank you for viewing.